What's going on guys? This is me Mehdi Shakil and you are watching SS Tech Tutorial. So guys in this video I am going to show you that how you can flash the stock firmware on any Samsung Galaxy device. Assume that somehow your Android phone get brick and now to fix it you have to flash the stock firmware. So after watching this video you will be easily able to flash the stock firmware on any Samsung Galaxy device. So without further ado let's get started. But before that, if you're new to this channel, then please do subscribe to this YouTube channel. And if you have already subscribed, then thank you so much. This is my Samsung Galaxy A7 device. And here you can see it show this error. This phone get bricked while updating. Now after getting this message, if you try to reboot your phone, it will get stuck at Samsung logo boot loop. So now watching this video, you can solve most of the Samsung device software issues like phone brick, boot loop or firmware upgrading. So let's get started. First of all, we have to boot our phone into downloading mode. To do that, we have to press and hold the power key, volume down key and Bixby key together until you get this warning screen. Then press the volume up key and our phone will boot into download mode. Now from here, you can see your phone model, what you should note down. Because using this number, we have to download the firmware for our device. Now connect your device using a USB cable with a laptop or PC. Okay. So guys, now you can see my computer screen and here you need to download the requirement files and software. So open up any browser, then search on Google for the firmware using the model number. Then use SAM mobile website or SAM FW website to search for the specific firmware of your Samsung phone. Select your phone model, country and the Android version from here. Then download the firmware for your phone. Now take another tab and search for Odin download. Then go to this website and download the latest Odin software. We are going to use this Odin software to flash the stock firmware into our phone. After downloading get completed, open up Odin software. And from here you can ensure that your phone has been detected with your computer or not. If your phone not get detected, you have to install Samsung USB driver on your computer. Now select the BL file, AP file, CP and CSC and user data file from the downloaded stock firmware into this Odin software. Then click on flash and Odin will flash the firmware file into your phone. It will take a while so you have to wait. Remember do not unplug your phone while flashing. It may cause more damage to your phone. When the flashing get completed it will automatically reboot your phone. For the first time boot it will take some time. So don't panic just wait. If in case it not get boot or stuck on boot loop then just again go to download mode and only flash the AP file to your phone and your problem will get fixed 100%. Here you can see my phone is restarted and ready for setting up. And now we have to configure the basic setting to use our phone normally. So guys that's all for today. I hope you like this video. If you really like this video and enjoy this video then please give it a big thumbs up and share this video with your friends. And guys if you need to this channel then please do subscribe to this YouTube channel and don't forget to press the bell icon to get all the latest upcoming video tutorial notification. I'm Mehdi Shakil, you're watching this tech tutorial and I'm signing out.